Hey YouTube, it's David again. I am on a tangent with the uh, Grot Tank. Uh, right now I uploaded um, the uh, actual model into Tinkercad and now I want to make some uh, changes. I'm going to show you the model real quick. Look at that big gap under that. It looks unsightly. So we have this piece right here. Let's see if I can move around it. That's going to go on the bottom. It's inverted because it's you can't print it the other way around without supports. This is going to be the front, add a little bit of uh, detail to it. I might put some bolts or something in there, I'm not sure. And then I made a new turret. There's the old uh, round turret right there, we can see my, my, my mouse. And there's a new one I'm working on right now, with uh, got some bolts in it, it's got a little detail, it's a, a round, like flat one. I put a, a viewport in it, then it'll have a mounting area for a gun of some sort. I'm not sure if I'm going to use the uh, the minigun or design something different like a big shooter, something a little more for uh, designed for the game and even maybe possibly um, I may probably keep this, I may even, you can even design totally new ones, that's the thing that's really cool about the 3D printer I'm just using this for scale basically and then uh, here's the other gun, I was thinking about doing like uh, let's see you can go down in here and there's um, a tube so I can take a tube like this and kind of make it, let's see what that is, let's say 11 by 11. Let's see if that would be big enough for there. A little bit smaller, let's do 9. 9, uh, nine by 9. And we, oops, uh, extend it up, make it nice and long. And then we can take, um, we're having a flat circle in here. A cylinder hole, here we go. And we take this and make this 9.5 by 9.5. Oops, what did that work? Okay, there we go. Let's see, we can take it in just, it's almost the same size there. We're going to lift it up. And then we're going to do this, tilt it a little bit. I'm going to make it a little bit bigger. Actually, we're going to have to make it bigger. And maybe change the, uh, dra not such a drastic uh, thing. And then we can just do uh, shift, 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 and group it. Oh, that didn't turn out really well. So let's do ungroup. Okay, that's what's happened. I'm going to kind of keep your eye on this thing all the way around. Let's make this a little bit bigger. So it's... There we go. And we can bring it down a little bit. And we're gonna... Okay, let's try to do that. Um, group it again. There. So now we got a slanted gun. And we can actually um, add some detail to it and make a different looking little gun. We can make um, uh, any kind of um, orc uh, cannon we want. And that would be kind of cool, a Grodzuka or whatever we want to add on to it. So this is going to be just a really quick update on what I'm doing on 3. Uh, I think I like to, when I print a new tank out, I want it to be uh, updated a little bit different, that I want to do this piece here to put it on the bottom of this to make it a little more complete. Yeah, it's just not, does not look right. Um, what I could do with this too, see what we make to see what this is going to look like. One 
let's do some color differences on it. Let's make it uh, a little bit darker gray so we can see the difference. And we want to spin this around too. Let's do... Um, Oh, it seems that we're going to have to make some changes anyways. So let's um, see we're going to spin this around 180 degrees. Oops, wrong way. Control Z. Where is my turner around her? There we go. No. No. Where can we spin this thing around yet? Let me get this out of here real quick. Oh, shoot. Control Z. There we go. 180 degrees. There. Put it right here. Because this is designed for this tank. And then we're going to have to shrink it down a little bit. Let's go down to uh, 40. See what happens. Oh, that's way better. So, I'm going go in on that. Back it up. Um, there we go. So we can widen it a little bit if we want, or no, we can leave that. We leave those bolts. Let's do a little wider. Let's do. it out so then it uh, lines up with those um, that rivet band and this back side needs to be shrunk a little bit so you just grab this little black dot here and then go to right there nice so there we have it nice and clean and a really simple upgrade and I think that'll look so much nicer um, so that is it for this little part three and we'll uh, see you in the next video hopefully we'll be printing this thing out Thanks again.